Yet to us, so concern for from Mum Penny and other Dunker Kufuado, Sir Bay, as in Kitania, obey ye be a dear boy, my bumble phone so. One name will be be a year come and watch me about by ye and son of Omber now or dear man. Oman Penny and the Dunker Kufuado, as the Sujia say, a bay, as in Kitty, Sir Wonum, a dear candy beer a police for here, a bema Wonum. Sabi ya wano mejuma bitu miya kwa nkaino. Kwa chile muse, baimbo ni ibi ya wanyabe yu papa di niti tuwano e yubi ya sumjiye e wani mu. Ya ubiti miya tuwa so, ama saa sumjiye nu, abo mehemu ni mu nina. The Security Services Housing Project, which we embarked upon in 2018 during my first term of office, is aimed at providing decent housing for our gallant men and women in uniform. These 320 housing units, symbolize our resolve to ensuring that those who risk their lives daily to protect us have a safe and comfortable place to call home. Ladies and gentlemen, the importance of adequate housing for our security personnel is self-evident. When our police officers have access to decent accommodation, it enhances their morale and improves considerably their effectiveness in maintaining law and order. Kwa juo pa unkroma ayo swafu wa show works and house and so, jumedi na siya no wano sudi tu just say. The 2018 project situated at the Eastern Naval Command in Tema helped to ameliorate the housing challenges confronting the Ghana Navy. It comprised of a fully gated barracks made up of 23 blocks each with 16 flats giving a total of 368 homes to the Ghana Armed Forces. The barracks also had a multi-purpose sports facility and a playing ground for personnel and families. It was commissioned on the 12th of March 2018 by His Excellency the Vice President, Dr. Mahmoud Baumia. Subsequent to this, 312 homes, the first phase of the 514 homes that the interior minister referred to for the police service were built and commissioned by the president in Kwabenya in 2023.